Cause he he you can tell when he speak about it, he genuine man. When I yeah. met Snoop, he really told me how my dad embraced him, other than anybody else at No Limit. You know what I'm saying? And how they really clicked. How he was one of the most authentic people that he met over there. Yeah, we on Boss Talk One On One. Yeah, we gonna talk. Not the one, not the two, not the three, the four. Man, the thank y'all, man, so much for supporting us, man. Y'all family, man. Appreciate y'all, man. All the like time. I said, when we come, we just. We just coming with, with 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 really open hearts, right? Like yes, we just sir. be chilling, man. I ain't gonna lie to you. You know you he he been up to the store. I told him I gotta bring you up there. Yeah, to to Dallas. To, to Dallas. 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 Yeah. yeah, and I called you. I remember every time I called you. When I was in Chicago, I called you. Yeah. And yeah. when I when I was in Atlanta, I didn't. I said, "Man, let me call." And that's how I got you. She was like, "Nah, he man, he down there now. I think I think you were staying down there at that time. Mm -hmm. I was but. living on Peter Street." But I just appreciate y'all, man. It's, it's only God that opened these doors, bro. The you know what I'm saying? It wouldn't be happening like this if it wasn't. You know what I'm saying? Um, you know, um, like I said, we, we definitely, it's always in, in, in honor and memory of your brother and your dad. You know what I'm saying? Everybody in this city love your brother mm -hmm. and your dad. We've yes. been hearing this every we hear every so many interview, bro. Every time. So many stories. I'm serious. Like, we can talk to anybody, even people that ain't down here. Talk about this dude, man. How and kind he was and loving for his community. Yes. Yeah. That's that's the picture that we always um mm -hmm. you always find interesting. Um a lot of um times with rappers they paint the the bad portrait. Um but often the time a lot of people they don't get to still hear stories about their loved ones and the impact that they made on people's lives. So right. um we still get to hear those stories, so that's always exciting to hear. Right. Yeah. Have yeah. you do you still be hearing stories that you never heard before? All the time. All the time. It's always a new story. Yeah. Really? It's and it, always and it, a new person's story. Than you, than you know. Right. Yeah, yeah it's always positive. The, yeah, it's always positive. It's always like, positive. It's, never, it's funny. Oh man, your dad to beat this person, it'll never be that. It'd be how he impacted them or how he got them to do something that was positive to help mm -hmm. them. Like somebody said to, to us the other day, like, man, if Tupac was still alive and Soldier Slim was still alive, imagine that collaboration between them two. Right. It would be crazy. I think they would be able to get all three of them on the track, right? Him, Biggie, and Tupac. And I mean, it, it would it would be a hard track, right? Mm -hmm. What? Well, even if it was just him snooping, Snoop, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Tupac. Yeah, yeah. It that would, would be, be a hard, hard. track. I, I think that's that's the whole game. I like like they always talk about uh, Snoop and how much he lo loved uh, you know uh, Soldier Slim, and I think that's hard, man. Like, cause he he you can tell when he speak about it, he genuine, man. When I you met know? Snoop, he really told me how my dad embraced him, other than anybody else at No Limit. You know what I'm saying? And how they really clicked. How he was one of the most authentic people that he met over there. Wow, that's the whole game. Like, I'm telling you. It had to be something special. Everybody not going to say the same thing with about him. you. Right. And he let you smoke with he him? Let me smoke with him. What would you, you say? Damn, smoking with Snoop. Man, really, when my cousin <laughs> called me, like at this time it was during COVID. Um, it was right before COVID. Okay. In fact, um, my cousin called me like, where you at? You in the city? Because he knew at the time I used to stay at all the hotels on Canal Street. Yeah. Just do my yeah. thing out the hotels. Um, but he was like, man, Snoop right here at the film mode. You know what I'm saying? You want to meet you, my cousin Gateway, huh? He was like, you want to meet you? I was telling about you, you know, you come over here. Wow. And he called me, and I had missed the show, but I still went over there, and yeah, it was love. Wow. I, I'm telling you, man, when we went to the place last night, H-O-B or whatever you, yeah, you called it, because I, I don't, I'm being real with you. I was like, I'm going in. I said, I got another dude coming. I said, little soldier, he coming. And he was like, Okay, no worries. I was like, give him this. You know, he's like, nah. He, he, Y'all got a lot of love in this city, man. Yeah, well, people love. Yeah, they love. Man, it's, it's, I mean, Sharani you, you last so time she was yeah, like, Sharani's she a like, girl. man, I, man, Peach. Oh, I love her. Like, like, it's just a, it's amazing, bro. Mm -hmm. That even, even Mac when I interviewed him, like. Everybody I interview, bro, they love y'all, man. And y'all got to embrace that for what it is, man. Right. That's how. That's the whole way of keeping uh, your brother's legacy alive is just embracing those things. You know, I tell you that all the time. But like, see, I, I hear a lot of stories about, like, even before it was the love for my pops, my grandma had that love already. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's hard. That's yeah. hard. So yeah, she, you got to be a long line of good people. Yeah. So it's just being good people. Like, it's not, we don't think we better than 
anybody else. We still your typical people who have to do maybe go to work or just, you know, work for what we want. So we still just good people. So it's, it's embedded in you. Like if you good people, you good people. Um, you don't change up, but be Hollywood. Like, you know, some people, a small bit of any tiny little affliction or, you know, big stream would make them change up. But I mean, we still the same old people. This is us every day. Yeah. We good to people, so they good to us sometimes. sometimes. But <laughs> we good to people, so you know, they good to us sometimes. Huh? Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.